Hello everybody, welcome back to Scott's Honest Reviews and here we have a touchless foaming soap dispenser. So this one is a little different, it requires three AA batteries, but the great thing and why I got this is it works with foaming soap and my wife and I love foaming soap, it's all we, basically all we use. Now you can also use this with detergent, you just have to add water. Um, Use method. Install the batteries according to the positive and negative. Install the hand sanitizers as shown in the steps. Press the back on off button three seconds. Then the indicator light flashes. Hand take the foam and rinse it about 10 seconds. Then clean your hands. So it even tells you so you how to clean your hands. Here's the installation instructions as well. So let's go ahead and get unboxing. And like always, you guys can find this product in my video description directly from the seller now um, I do reviews for fun um, and all my reviews are honest so everything I say you can um, be rest assured that you know it's not some fake paid or some some stupid review so we got pink my wife likes pink and um, so here we go we got looks like a little reservoir there Actually, it's really basic. This is a pretty basic system, it looks like. So, um, there we go. It's like a light pink. Why is there like a... What? That's weird. Can you guys see this? There's like a little smiley, smiley face symbol upside... Oh, right side up. Is that supposed to be there? So you kn know... Is that the sensor, maybe? <laughs> the smiley face? That's, that's, that's kind of cool. <laughs> so it looks like this would go slide right up like that looks like you would take I'm guessing you take this out here and you would fill up the soap in here put it back on probably slide this up it didn't it doesn't snap in so it just kind of sets in and it looks like oh the sensor it's probably right here. Not sure why this is a smiley face. I don't know if that lights up or something. So there's the on off button. Here would be for the batteries, which we'll go ahead and put them in. So stay tuned, guys. And we are back. Let's go ahead. If you guys could do me a favor and subscribe to my channel, that would mean a lot to me. It's definitely hard to grow on YouTube, so it definitely would mean a lot. Alright, so we got them in. They do not supply batteries, um, so keep that in mind. So this is a little... There we go. Um, so press and hold three seconds. I know, we didn't have to press and hold. Oh, look at that. Look at that, guys. So how close do you have to get? Okay. What if we just press it? Now it's red. What does that mean? It... Oh, you don't have to press and hold. I wonder why it said press and hold three seconds. Let's go back here real quick. Uh... Press the on off button three seconds, then the indicator light flashes. Well, I don't know if you guys are going to have to do that. We just simply pressed it once quickly and it turns it off. Press it again quickly, turns it on. So, all right, let's go ahead and fill this up with some soap. So, stay tuned, guys. Okay, so we have two different uh, foam soaps here, but. We are going to let's let's move this out of the way so we can have this box here. We're gonna lay that in the box. Now let's see if we can do this without making a mess. Oh, I love foam soap. It smells so good.
Okay, so what I'm going to do is these are similar uh, scents, so we're just going to mix two and the one. You know, we're going to fill it up. I think we're going to have some left over. Okay, got a little left over. I wish you guys could smell this. It smells so good. So now go ahead and place this down in here. Make sure you have the lid on tight. Now, if you're not using this, make sure you put your uh, little cap back on if you're not going to be using it. But if you're using it, go ahead, slide it right up in and it's in there now it's not in there solid so you want to hold make sure you hold it by the base you know keep it with you as you're going um, carrying it along and hopefully we have it off okay let's go to the sink alright guys welcome back so go ahead and place it wherever you want your dispenser at so I want I guess we can zoom up to show you guys Close, so we're gonna press the button. Now it's on. So look at that. Just like that. It works perfectly. You don't have to touch it, you just get your hand close. And you're good to go. Now I do recommend putting it somewhere, right now where I have it setting, it's a little close to, uh, you know, if we're just randomly around here, it might trigger it. So we're going to go ahead and move it back over here further away, so now when we go up, we can go up to it, and we're good to go. Yeah, works excellent, very cool. So I wonder if it, it looks like it blinked. I wonder if it blinks every so often or not. Maybe if you're in the area. Not quite sure. You know, if you get close, maybe it blinks. I don't know. Anyway, um, so yeah, it works perfectly. And I think my wife is going to be very thrilled with it. And it blinks red when you know it's turning off. So, yeah, very happy. I'm gonna, I'm very happy. Um, I wish I would have got more of a manly color. But hey, the cool thing is, it's got a nice flat top up here. So you could probably put something up here if you want. Um, no, I don't know. You could set something up here, whatever you want to set. You know, our toothpaste, we could set my toothpaste up there, but. Yeah, it's got a nice flat top for something, and yeah, overall, I mean, it's not the, a color I would pick, but you know, my wife likes the color, that's why we picked this color, um, so, if it was black, because I, I love black, I would, I would have to say, I, I would have to give this a 9 to a 10 out of 10, I, I don't, there's nothing I would say that's negative about it, other than, you know, like there, you know, when you... Um, press it up in it doesn't it doesn't really stay so as you go up in it doesn't stay so you have to hold just hold the whole thing until you set it down so if you go to change it out you know don't just grab it by that grab it by the whole base I think that's the only thing keeping it from a 10 out of 10 but that's not even a big deal I mean so it works great and I, from my honest opinion I can give it a 9 out of 10 um, yeah, a 9 out of 10 is my honest opinion, and it's good price. So, yeah, very happy. And the great thing is you can buy, this is another thing, it'll save money in the long term because you can buy the uh, actual soap. Looks like there's still a little coming out probably since we moved it around a little or still some in the tube. Um, but, yeah, you can actually buy the soap and... Uh, 
cheaper, like the liquid, cheaper than buying the actual bo you know, plastic bottle because they actually charge a markup for that bottle even though you, you're basically just getting liquid. So you can actually go and buy liquid and get it cheaper because you can buy the liquid in bulk. So yeah, it gets a 9 out of 10. Very happy. Good product.